Hi there, it's Debbie from My Vagabond Style, and today I'm going to do something a little different. I'm bringing you a Timu haul. Timu is a online uh, place where you can buy all kinds of stuff, and it's kind of like, I guess, maybe Wish. Um, there's another one, I can't remember the name, but most of the stuff I think probably comes from China. So you just order online, and it comes to you in about maybe two weeks, sometimes a little quicker. They give you a date on there. If it doesn't come by the, a certain date, they've been giving like $5 off. But uh, mine came on time, actually a couple days early. I think it took about 10 days to get here. And so I'd like to show you what I got because I'm pretty happy with everything. Uh, there's a couple things I haven't tried yet, so the jury's out on that. I'll have to let you know. But start with this. So I ordered this little silicone silicone mat, and this was three dollars and thirty eight cents. And I think this is going to be great for when I'm working here at the desk, and I just need a little. I don't want to get anything on my uh, board here, so I think this will be wonderful. So I was happy with that, and. If, if, if I don't think I want to use it for that, I probably could use it in my toaster oven. So, let's see. And the next thing I got, I got several stencils. And they were very cheap. This is $0.68 cents for this one. Kind of looks like script. And then I got this one. And I think I can use these when I'm using my um, my gel print for um, making papers, you know, painted papers. So I'm going to try it on that. And, yeah, all of these were, well, this one was $0.62. Cents. Some of them were $0.68. Cents. Anyway, they were very inexpensive. And that one's kind of fun. And here's that one. So those will be good. The next thing I got, this was only $1.58. I haven't tried them yet, but they look like they'll be just fine. So for $1.58, I'm thinking those are good. There's quite a few stamps on here. The next thing I got was this little corner rounder. And the corner rounder was $1.58. And it's just a, a really tiny one when you just want to maybe cut off a little round the edge just a tad without taking much out of it. As you can see, it was just a slight, takes that harsh edge off of it. Um, it does have the little bottom part here where it catches the off cut. And then you can empty it. So for $1.58, that's a pretty good deal. Uh, let's see. Oh, I got these. These are, I thought for collage, these would be awesome. They're just little pins that are actually razor blades. And they came six of them to the pack. And they were $1.98. So I tried it the other day on something, and I was pretty happy with it. You just, it looks, it has a, an edge here. But yeah, that works awesome. Very sharp. I don't know how long they'll last, but there's six of them. I don't, <laughs> probably last a long time. I already sent one to a friend. So there's those. And I got gel pins, which were a really good price for gel pins. These were $2.49, six white ones. So I have tried them and they work great. They work just like a jelly roll. Now I don't, like I said, I don't know how long they'll last, but um, we'll try them. Okay, then I got some stickers, 
These were 50 count for a dollar eight. And I really like these because they are pretty realistic looking. And they have a clear cutout, so you don't have to mess with it. it I used one already and I, I liked it on the project I was using it for. So 50 count, that's awesome. And then I got them also in the yellow. I hope you can see these okay. The yellow has, it's funny, that yellow had a couple of like bluish ones in there. Let's see if I put it on this white piece of paper. Yeah, I can see them better. All different styles or flowers. Okay, let me get them all back in here. I got some washi tape. The washi tape, I am very happy with. I actually saw this one for about double the price on Amazon the other day. I paid $6.98 for this. And it's got all different sizes. And some really beautiful prints. I hope that's coming in okay. Anyway, um, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? The sticky on here is not very sticky, but um, I'm okay with that because I usually glue stick it or use a little bit of the art glitter glue on it. But I just thought they were awesome. Let me see if I can get that off. Okay, here we go. No. <laughs> yeah. That is so pretty. I am working on putting together anything. We're actually going to Mexico for five months. And I am in the process of deciding what I want to take. I do have supplies down there, but, um, you know, I just got all this new stuff and I want to take everything, but I don't have room. We are driving this time down to Mexico and it'll take us about three nights, four days of driving to get down there. And um, so I don't have a ton of room. We have a small car. Anyway, I will figure it out and probably stick stuff in every nook and cranny of that car. <laughs> okay, these, these gentlemen were 88 cents. And I like them. They're very dapper. Yeah, they're good. Why does this autofocus not work very well? Anyway, so those would be great for collage and different different things. I don't remember how many were in here, maybe 20 or so. Oh, I missed a stencil or two. This was a pack of them. Let me open them. Okay, this pack was $1.98. Some, I don't even know what that is. Like maybe, almost looks like stars. Some of the cutout is not cut out here. I can work on that later. Another one. And then this one. Uh, 
Then I got some daubers, ink daubers for $2.19. There's 10 of them in here. I've never used these, so I'll be taking some of these with me and see how I like them. And then I got a pair of scissors for $1.78. Let's see how these are. I will cut something. They're pretty, a nice weight. Oh, I think they'll be good. All right. I have my cutter bees, but my cutter bees, I don't know if I did something to them when I tried to put them into the, the you know, the guard. They're a little off now. So I might just leave these here and take these with me. But that's a really good price, $1.78. I think these cutter bees, uh, I don't know, were they like nine or ten bucks on Amazon? Okay, and then I got these free with my order paint pens. I don't know how good they're going to be. You know, nothing beats the, uh, what are they called? Posca? Posca. These are so good. But for free, I will give them a try. I got a brush, a blending brush for ink. I have not tried these before. This was 60, no, 89 cents. Um, I don't know if that's a good price or not, but I thought I'd give it a whirl. I also got, I'm really excited about this. Um, these, they call them deco papers, but mostly there's stickers in here. This was $3 and 48 cents, but there's a ton of stuff in here. They've got some stickers that look like stamps and like some wax looking wax seals, more stamps. I do like these kind of washy stickers. There's quite a few of that. And then these are just decoupage paper. And there's some nice images. Just like postcards and such. What else is in here? Uh, more fun images. And then some bigger pieces. Nice. So yeah, there's there's quite a bit of stuff in here. It's just on white backed paper. But that's good. I'm happy with that. Did I say I paid $350? Yeah. Definitely, definitely worth it. Maybe I'll just move these to the side here. And let's see what else. Oh, I got these. This was a dollar twenty-eight. There's, it's a fifty count of a lot of different images. They're nice, nothing, nothing special, 
but when you need a small image, these are great. So there's that. Um, and I think the rest, there's like five different other things that I got that are not craft related, but I'll throw them in on this haul. So I got this little chair, which actually holds your phone. It was 58 cents, but when you need, um, you know, something to kind of place your phone on as you're crafting and, you know, watching other people's videos, that's what I do. Um, I thought that was good. And it actually does hold, hold it fine, even though it's really, you know, cheapy plastic. Then, okay, we have this dog, Chaba, that is a runner. He loves to, any chance he gets, he'll dart out the door. And he's fast. He is like the wind. So most of the time we have to like jump in the car and go get him. But he doesn't get out that often, but enough that, you know, oh my gosh, we would just be devastated if we lost him. So there's this thing I got called um, a find tag. I've, I've heard about them. This works with Apple products. Um, it was $11.50. I'm going to try to put it on his collar and just see if um, if it works. <laughs> it's worth a try. Uh, and then I also got this for the, our road trip. It was a dollar twenty-eight, and this goes into your seat belt, and um, I can attach the dog to it. I have two dogs, but the other one's not a runner. But I thought this would be good because we could at least make sure when we go to get out the car on the road that um, Chapa doesn't bolt. <laughs> Might be a dollar twenty-eight well spent. And then I got these nail wraps. I I had one before, but I got it on clearance, and um, they were I think they were too old. So I thought I'd give these a try. These were like forty-four cents, and then this one was eighty-eight cents. So I'm gonna try those. I'll let you know how they go. And I think that's it. Yes, that is it. So if you haven't tried Timu, um, I'd give it a try. Uh, I don't think, I, I did order a couple pieces of clothing. Um, and because they were from China, I did read the reviews thinking they were going to be too small. But so I ordered like one or two sizes bigger and they're really big. So I guess if it says it's true to size on the review, <laughs> you probably should follow that. Um, one thing was, I, I think would run a bit small, even though it said it didn't. So clothes are really hard to buy from these kind of places, I think. Um, most everything, I didn't, I, I couldn't find whether it was polyester or not, but Everything I ordered was polyester. So if you do not want polyester, I would suggest not buying from there. Or look really hard in the details and find out what it is. And and sometimes it's that really not fun polyester, uh, you know, scratchy. So, yeah, not good. Anyway, I am going to go continue packing for the trip. And um, I think that's it. So. Thanks for watching and I will catch you guys later. Bye.